what a poet is doing is, is closer to writing a musical score than to writing a list. I am Seamus Heaney. I was born on a small farm in the north of Ireland. I was the son of a farmer, a scholarship boy who went to school in a boarding school, who then went to university in Belfast, and who gradually began to uh, publish poetry in magazines. My own experience, my best experiences of writing poems. The first poet to bring me alive was Gerard Manley Hopkins. But as I became conscious of where I was, you know, I, um, I made a conscious uh, realignment of that. So I read Joyce and I read Yeats and I read Irish language poetry. My definition of poetry is something that is more than enough. And my own sense of the world is a sense of learning and poetry is one of the great learnings for me. I would say that every poem, every true poem, there is impulse which I would call nature. And there is technique, or techni, which uh, I would call poetry or art. But poetry isn't, I mean, it isn't just a matter, I think, of articulation, of expressing in a, with a scientific accuracy. It's, it's a matter of giving a sense of whole, when poetry is, is a form as much as anything else. And form fortifies the person who receives it, they reform around it for a second. You know. It's actually, it's the solitary part of the reader and the writer that it fortifies. And when the solitary part is brought into communication, that's real community. The poet should stand in front of silence and mystery in silence until something comes that is worth saying. And I am still imperially male, leaving you with the pain. The rending process in the colony, the battering ram, the boom burst from within. The act sprouted an obstinate fifth column, whose stance is growing unilateral. His heart beneath your heart is a war drum mustering force. His parasitical and ignorant little fists already beat at your borders, and I know they're cocked at me across the water. No treaty, I foresee, will solve completely your tracked and stretch-marked body. The big pain that leaves you raw, like opened ground, again. <laughs>